they want the drama Forget about what I bring to the table Those people want the drama What's up, AJC? I'm back with another video Back with um, more Mariah Carey memoir Vlogmas um, reaction uh, So, I'm sorry I'm going to be talking a little funny today My teeth are have my mouth swollen I mean, not swollen, but it hurts, okay? So, either way, um, let's finish where we left off, Pooh. And why couldn't she just sit me down and brush my hair for... I'm not gonna lie. This is what I be thinking about, like, people that's in interracial relationships. Mind you, I know it's, it's absolutely nothing wrong with that. I think it's absolutely beautiful. But I just be thinking about that, like, don't get me wrong. I don't necessarily have a desire to marry um you know a white man or anything but if i did or if i decided to marry an asian man or something like that it's just kind of like I, I i'll be thinking like well at least they're gonna be good at least they step up gonna know how to do hair like if you got kids or whatever and you know or because i ain't trying to have no more <laughs> but i don't know whatever you never know what the future holds but at the same time i always think of my husband like well at least he ain't gotta worry about if he got hair or if his kids got hair because i'm gonna be able to do hair you know what I'm saying? But I be thinking about like, you know, the men that get with get with uh women who aren't, you know, of color. It's kinda like uh <laughs> are they uh, do they care at all if the woman gonna be able to do the baby's hair? Or they just know they're gonna have them in a salon? Like how does that work? Oh, I forgot to show y'all. Look at my little I picked this up from Target because I was pressed when I seen it. I know it's old, this season's old or whatever, but I liked it, so I got it. But yeah, I don't know. Like, so so for instance, Mariah, mommy. Like, I wanted to even think about that. Like, well, how I'm gonna do this child hair? Or I don't know. Like, how could you not think about that? You got a whole live mixed child out here, you know. But whatever, that ain't my business. The way Marsha Brady did on the Brady Bunch. Nowhere. She didn't know. I love the fact that she's talking about her hair and her hair experience. As, uh, you know, a half black woman, I, 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 I love the fact that she's talking about this because she, she's showing all the people that, you know, thought she couldn't relate, which I don't know how you could ever think. Mind you, Mariah Carey looked more black than white to me. So I don't understand how a lot of these feelings that other people thought about her. I just don't understand. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, even though, even though we ain't see her in no bush wig, even though she be wearing the flawless you know what I'm saying? White girl hair, technically, uh, with her weeds and stuff like that. That's just as fabulous as she is. I still don't get how you can't see that she's not, uh, you know what I'm saying, black. Like, my grandmother made a comment about Mariah Carey a long time ago. I will never forget this because I got in trouble for my response to her. Well, I didn't get in trouble. I was grown. But still, she said, uh, she said, she wants to she wants to marry white men. She's gonna have white kids. And then as soon as uh she started having kids, I said, Oh, them kids look awfully black to me. And she was like, you know, she didn't have anything to say. And it was like, girl, mind your business. And yeah, we talk about my grandmother, but still, <laughs> mind your business. Like, but either way, she she's she's very in tune with her culture. She's very in tune with, you know, who she is as a person. And at the end of the day, like I just love the fact that she's harboring on this. I love the fact that she's talking about it because if she wasn't into her into her culture, into her, you know, her blackness, she wouldn't be talking about any of that. She wouldn't care nothing about it. She would say, I hated my hair growing up. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I wear wigs all the time. She's not saying that. She said, they didn't care for me properly growing up. And they did it. I, I feel, sis. Tell your truth, baby. Tell your truth. They did not care for her growing up. Okay. <laughs> it's important, you know what I'm saying, that people know this. She was confused and randomly started cutting tragic bangs in my hair, believing bangs would behave in biracial hair is brave. Right. It was a near my neck, followed immediately by an alarming searing and sizzling sound and an unfamiliar and vicious smell. Like oh, she getting a hot cone. I thought she was getting a relaxer. Along with significant smoke, a faint panic began to waft through the room. She getting a hot cone. I couldn't make out what I stayed motionless and quiet. She done burnt her hair off. of hair at the nape of my neck still smoldering. Girl Hair Society that day. Dang. I 
didn't emerge transformed into a presentable little girl for Harlem, Queens, or Long Island. The waist deep water reveling in the new. I mean, she is going deep into detail about this hair thing and about just being a black girl, period. And I'm just so appreciative of that. I'm so appreciative of that. Like that this 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 is little black girls, little mixed girls. They can listen to this and relate. This was beautiful. So, I mean, she ain't just touch on it. Like, she's spending time telling you how important this is. That's amazing. Like, kudos, Mariah. Come on. It's brought by my liberated curls. A sudden wall of ocean appear. Curl would be a Maria Maya calamity. Wow. I wouldn't meet another Mariah until I was about 18 years old. Powerful energy behind me. Six five. I turned around. And looking like a fly girl teen version of a Black Panther protest, there was a big, beautiful wall of, oh, we got your back, one of them said. Aww. And that was it. Those badass girls just let me know that when it got down to it, they were going to hold me down. Purr you, poo. Years later, I had made it out. Go ahead, girl. As I turned to get back in the car, size, 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 black and white, easy and fully as myself. His wow. power was pervasive. I couldn't go out or do anything with anybody. I couldn't move freely. In that's the sign. That's one of the first signs of abusers. The, they like to isolate you, and you can't. <sighs> they even like to isolate you from your family and your your best friends and um, stuff like that. I hope this man wasn't hitting on her, but I know for a fact that that's definitely a sign of um, abuse. So. But at the same time, abuse can be verbal too. So either way. Many nights I would lie on my side of our massive bed. I could emulate the popular Madonna studio technique, but with my voice alone. Come on now. By singing one of the songs they wrote. I don't need auto tune. I don't need no special effects. I could do this. I could do this for real <laughs> with my voice alone. <laughs> like I know what y'all used to. I know y'all used to loosey goosey. But I run a much tighter ship. Ain't that what Miss Doubtfire say? Baby. Mariah just... <laughs> she didn't mean it though, Shay. But she just... She kind of swung the tree. <laughs> Be on the spot. So, this is what came with it. I had entered the treacherous territory of the, the music industry. industry. Yep, I knew it. Though my journey was just beginning, then what was going on? I was too young to get it. And also... Because she wanted that voice. What's the tone for me, Paul? Cool. What's the tone for me? I figured out the setup. Y'all, let me stop here. Um, I will catch y'all in the next video, okay? See y'all in part. I don't lost count, whatever number we are. <laughs> I'll see y'all in a bit. We're fighting for peace. We're fighting for peace. We're fighting for unity. We're fighting for, We're fighting unity. for love. We're fighting, We're fighting for, for love. justice. We're fighting for justice. We are kings and queens.